have a clear conscience is not easy there is no other way except through knowing god's love your human dna knows it fully well so when you grow in the knowledge of god's word then you introduce god's word to that person and then when you study okay sin and death entered through one man so life and righteousness came through one man and then you study who is that one man what is his lineage who is that person who died and who claims that he has the power to forgive when you study his history where did he come from who is his father you study that and then you get to know the law that when a willing victim who has committed no treachery is brought to the stone table and is killed in the traitor's stead even the stone table would crack and death would work backwards it would reverse you see the law in place and you study the whole episode of the cross from the birth of jesus until he died until he resurrected you study the whole episode word to word you do a detailed study on it and you grow in the knowledge of his love and it all starts to make sense and now when you see from on the cross you see what about god's law you see that it is satisfied what about god's glory it is magnified what about god's judgment executed what about god's justice not compromised what about the penalty that the penalty of sin is death jesus died what about god's forgiveness granted amen. what about god's power jesus resurrected amen. amen when you see when the puzzle all comes together as you grow in the knowledge of god's love then you can have a clear conscience then your heart will not condemn you and then you have boldness and you have confidence that is the only way church you approach trying to have a clear conscience outside of god's word through inspiration through motivation people telling you just go for some shopping just ignore just divert your mind just go have a good meal all these things it can work for very little while and then you will fall flat but if you have deposited god's word in your heart if you have known the love of god maybe even if you start the worldly way of just going for some shopping or just having a good meal the holy spirit will start reminding you it will bring out what you have deposited it will remind you of his word it will remind you of his love and it will convince you to again stand up and go back to god boldly Amen so that is why we must grow in the knowledge of God's love This excerpt is brought to you by priyaabraham.org To get the full message visit priyaabraham.org